So after successfully launching a rocket all by myself, I also single-handedly blow up our space station. I'm so responsible. Last time, we launched a rocket by ourselves, without any training, in the middle of a dust storm. If I'm remembering correctly. Okay, they're gonna give us this cutscene again. Oh, they're gonna make me park again. Okay, I can do this. Perfect. All right. Well, ground control to the tuna one. You must have reached Pearson Space Station by now. The storm has severely damaged our instruments, so we can't read your location or receive any messages. But we can detect fluctuations in the MPT network. If you can hear this, when you reach the control center, try to find out what's wrong with the MPT connection so you can bring it back online. I already knew that's why I came here. <laughs> All right, where am I going? Am I going up there? Oh, here we go, there's a button. Okay. Oh, there we go. As construction continued and Isaac's responsibilities within the WSA crew, the distance between him and his family began to take its toll. I think there's a code or something I need to put there. There we go. I'm supposed to be fixing the power. Now where does this go? Oh, I think it goes in the door. The broken door. I think, question mark. There we go. There we go, easy. Easy. Uh, what's this? I think that was oxygen. I think I should have saved that. Wow, there's a lot of these. Um, I guess I keep looking around. Okay, there's another battery thing. Not quite sure where that's supposed to go. I think it's by the front door. Yeah, this thing right here. Here we go. Wait. Aha. Nothing. 
Internal mail, this side up, to Copernicus Moon Hub, used for space elevator drop. Well, how, what? What's in it? Any more lockers I can open up? Nope. Great. So, so far, I've managed to get one battery to power the station, but I can't find the second one. And I've been looking all over. Oh, wait, is it right here? Oh, my goodness, it's been right here this whole time. I can unplug this and stick it here. Oh, goodness. Stick it here. I need to get more oxygen. I am going to run out of oxygen soon. So now that this passage is opened on this side, I can take the power out from the other side. Smart brain I am. Stick that in there. So it was still the two that we were looking at originally. It's just... I rearranged them differently, and I need to go get some more air. Oh boy. Did I run out? Oh, I better not have run out. I ran out. Oh no. Uh, reboot, whatever it was. Uh. Oh goodness. <laughs> wow. That was so close. Okay, so now all the doors are open. Check the station's connection to the MPT network. Well, may as well go down this door that they opened for me. Central hub. Oh, great. More stuff to get lost in. Ooh, I can scan audio here. Copy control, we're all set. Ready for descent. The MPT network is still down, so expect the lights to go out as you descend towards Copernicus. Thanks for the heads up, Pearson. Remember, Sarah, our oxygen here in the station is limited. After arriving, you'll have 40 minutes to find out what caused the blackout and bring our MPT network back online. If you're not back by then, we'll have to evacuate without you. We hear you, control. Rolf, you ready? I am. And don't worry, control. It's probably just a glitch. We'll be back before you know it. Let's find out how they've been holding up down there. Alex, hmm. commence descent protocol. All systems go. Descent in three, two, one. Descending gate. Godspeed. Okay, well, let's go through here. Anything that I can scan? Love the music. Here we go. Pearson Space Elevator. Cool. I'll take it. Can I use it? I doubt I can right now, because we are running on very low power already. Probably can't support a full-on elevator to the moon. Long tunnel. Long tunnel is always a good sign that I'm going somewhere. Crew quarters. Oh, this is so cool. Okay, well, I didn't really mean to come down here. Yeah, it says in big letters, elevator offline. So, not really going to use that. I don't really have a clue as to where I'm supposed to be going next. I need to find the control center. Oh, I can just go through here. Wow. There you go, buddy. Almost there. We'll touch up your paint job later, don't worry. Are you ready to go? We've almost got the elevator running again. Yeah, just patching up Alex before we head down. Are you bringing that thing along? Of course. We'll need all the help we can get. And besides, you wouldn't have made it to that airlock if it hadn't been for him. <sighs> this MPT blackout can't be just a glitch, Rolf. Everything is still dark down there. Last time there was an outage. <sighs> did you hear the message from Earth? No. What did they say? They can't even send ships up here anymore without the MPT. It's crazy, right? We're the only ones able to investigate the blackout. Sarah, we need to get you guys down to the surface ASAP. We don't have much time. 
Okay, let's go. So is this control center or is this a... Aww! It's a living quarters. Oh, this is so cool. The guitar and everything. Did there used to be gravity in here? Will there be artificial gravity that I can turn on? Oh! Oh! Okay. This is a mess. Let's see what we can do. MBT is offline. Back up power, find out if you're station. Okay. Okay, I'll try to go to the control center now. Oh, this is Rolf's room. Cairo sleep machinery. So, Cairo sleep generators are malfunctioning. And Rolf was examining it. One of the few survivors of the Cairo sleep malfunction. Recently come across a fragment recovered from the Okay. There's Earth. So cool. Okay. Control center. It probably won't let me in. Oh no. Uh, here we go. Okay. Whoa, big room. All right, let's start with the right. Council members. The past few months, my team and I have encountered problems with the construction of material shipments. Supposed to be finished with the Orion Wing by now, but again, we missed our milestone due to shipments being repeatedly canceled. Hmm. Okay, let's see what we can do here. Rotate station. Okay, what's this area? Oh boy. I gotta rotate it for more power. Um... Don't know what I just now did, but okay. Okay, there we go. Alright, what am I trying to do here? I honestly don't know. I know that I want to cut those. Okay, but now what? Is the button gonna work? Why isn't the button working? What is it that I need to do out here? Power station rotation engine. Well, would this be it? Oh no, I need to find a battery. Breathe. Oh wait, I can just cut through there. Just the button. Oh man. I'm gonna try this one more time.
And I'm just able to cut through it. Yeah, yeah. Under control. I've only died twice. This would be completely different if there was a monster chasing me, but it's just me. Okay. Here we go. Copy that. Do you think we'll finish construction anytime soon? Uh, the council claiming more supplies each week? I doubt it. I'm surprised we got this past MacArthur in the first place. <laughs> yeah. Hey, listen, I'm getting strange readings here from the lunar surface. Are you seeing anything? Just wrapping up. What the hell? All the lights are shutting down. Ooh, the blackout. What just happened? I can't see a thing. Everything is dark out here. We lost power from the MPT. The whole station is down. Can you find your way back to the airlock? Negative. I don't have a visual. Right. I'm sending Alex to block the airlock doors. Do you see him? I see his flashlight. Heading back to the airlock. What's going on? Everything on the surface is dark. Rolf, not now. What's your ETA? Ten seconds. Make it faster. Once the airlock seals, you'll be locked out. Alex is blocking the door for you, but he can't hold it much longer. Never go out without your ASC by your side. Well, I don't have an ASC. Hmm. What am I doing here? Gotta get through all this. Oof. Pearson Space Station was never completed. They ever saw the construction of the final wing until the Lunar Council member MacArthur's suspension as a material, diverting all resources to a classified project on the moon. So they stopped us from getting our materials for our space station for a classified project. Interesting. Maintenance, here we go. Ow. Maybe I won't go through there. Can I use my new zappy thing to do something? Maybe I just need to be extra careful. Oh yeah, I just gotta be careful. There we go. What am I doing? Ooh, this is where recordings were taken. Life support systems. Cool. Rotation engine. Oh no, I need to find four more batteries. Where am I to find batteries? Ooh, how about in here? That was an import. Ooh. I like how we can just break stuff that's in our way without questioning the outcomes of it. It's not like we're in space or anything. Okay. Grab that. Yeah, I had a feeling this would have consequences.
that gave me oh well I had a feeling I'd have to start that over Okay, now it's time for anxiety. Scares are just the worst. Yep, I thought it'd be a combination of the two. Okay. How am I supposed to? Oh. Right. Lovely. Okay, one last try. Alright, time for the last one. Which is supposedly the hardest. Oh, why am I even doing this? Yep, 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 yep. Okay. Goodness, calm down. <laughs> My heart's beating so fast. How do I get in there? Ah, I'm going down here. Oh boy. Okay. 
Okay, I'm just gonna grab him as fast as I can while I get there. I'm gonna go the most direct approach as I can. Gotta get in there, cut the things open, and press the button. Okay, that thing's gonna blow up. Oh, oh, okay. Right, there's one down there. I think. I hope. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Gotta keep moving. No. Ah. Okay, there's an oxygen in there, and that's where I'm trying to go over there. So I've really got to hurry. Okay. I've got this. The music is just making it so much more stressful. Let me in. Oh. oh, goodness. This is the most stress I can't even I can't even think of the words nerve-wracking stress inducing anxiety provoking the controller vibrates like crazy at just the right times this is amazing it's gonna take me a while to recover from that I think that was the end of chapter two though let's see if there's another cutscene Oh, oh, oh. oh yeah, I'm on the moon. So, after successfully launching a rocket all by myself, I also, single-handedly, blow up our space station. I'm so responsible. But, there we have it. I'm on the moon base, and... I think... This is where we call it quits. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Like, subscribe, you know what to do. If you like it, thumbs up. If you don't like it, thumbs down. If you want to see more, subscribe. And if there's anything you want to see me do different, tell me in the comments. But, that's it. See you next time.